I've always loved racing. It's been a passion of mine for quite a long time, for you know many years. I enjoy watching it, and I've been lucky enough to get to participate in it. And you know, it's fast, it's loud, it's fun to be in the cockpit of the car and pushing yourself and trying to get every bit that you can out of yourself and to try to constantly do better. It's just a very exciting hobby to have. Group four coming up next is the number one qualifier in SRF, number 87, Rob Wilkie. On the racetrack, there's this concept of the perfect lap. And every lap, there are hundreds, if not thousands, of small decisions and actions that you're making. Ideally, if you could make all of those perfectly, you're gonna have the best outcome, the best lap. Part of that is to try to slow things down as you're driving and not let the speed of everything get ahead of you. If you can slow things mentally, it all starts to fall into place. And that way, racing's a lot like plastic surgery. We're making thousands of decisions and actions every procedure, and my goal is to make them the best I possibly can so that we can get the best result for our patients. I've been at Edina Plastic Surgery for almost 23 years, and the relationship I have with the patients I think has, has been really so important and has been one of the greatest satisfactions in my career. I think ultimately though, what, what makes it really great is that we get to help people achieve their goals and you know, day-to-day -day basis, we're helping people accomplish things that they just can't quite accomplish on their own. And you improve their confidence and you hopefully improve their lives with that. Plastic surgery is important because when you look in the mirror and you don't feel good about what you see, uh, it, it can affect all aspects of your life. And when you feel better about things, it can really help you blossom as a person in other ways too. And we've seen that many times where it's made a difference well beyond just the physical changes that we've been able to achieve for them. That's what we're there for. And that's what we get up and go to work every day to help them accomplish their goals. My profession's giving me some special opportunities that I'm really grateful uh, for having. And one of the most impactful has been the chance to do medical mission trips to underprivileged countries. And we've been able to go and do cleft lip and palate repairs for these kids who otherwise probably wouldn't get any medical attention. And that's just been incredibly gratifying to be able to provide that for them. But I think that's one of the great things about our specialty. And um, I think that's, that's one of the reasons why I just enjoy it so much. I've been very fortunate to be a part of Edina Plastic Surgery. We've been leaders in the industry and that's something we want to continue. We're still growing and still trying to get better every day and we do want to be better tomorrow than we were yesterday. We never quit learning and that's done through continuous education but also just through perfecting the art of the surgery that we do. Uh, I think one of the great things is we are a group practice. I've got some great partners and I learn from them. I think they learn from me and we hope to be able to provide a a lot more care to a lot more people over the years and anybody considering plastic surgery should come in and talk to us.